What is going on, everyone, and welcome back to another episode of Homestead Arcana. My name is Jacksons. In the last episode, we did not do too much. We just got ourselves started with a little kid here, made ourselves a little tent and all. If you guys missed that last episode, go ahead and check that one out. Video should be in the top right corner. Go watch that and come back and join us. So I had stopped this just before uh, opening this mailbird. I actually didn't even realize that I was supposed to be opening this mailbird the last time. Kind of skipped over it on accident. So let's do that right now. Jezebel, this is a reminder that the purpose of the Homestead Arcana program is the delivery of supplemental goods as required by Little Rock Council. On occasion, occasions may arise where a shortage occurs as there is delicate balance of crops, potions, materials, and other supplies. Under such circumstances, we will pay double for the completion of that job. You're doing Little Rock a great service. Remember where you came from, Homesteader. It's what this is all for. Councilman Wilmer yep. Narrows. Always check your mail. And your packages, too. Never know what you'll get. And, so you uh, say. Make sure to take advantage when Abraham's here so you can sell your produce for silver. Huckleberry seems to be yeah, very vague Paris. about a lot of this. Yes. Okay. I'm glad it's Look. not... He noticed because I, I thought he did to too. Oh, absolutely. That's where I'm going Town like directly after this. When you want to go back in there, talk to me. I'll give you a device that'll help you breathe easy. Ah, okay. Hell yeah. Well, I want to do that right now. Talk. So if you don't, there's not anything else I want to do, right? Actually, I did want to sleep the night away if possible just to see what happens. I didn't know if like maybe another bird might appear or if we'd get more mail in the uh by the morning so i want to see it, what actually happens oh shit there is uh, <laughs> there actually is a new message jezebel hope huck is looking after you all right pops could use some oh abraham just showed up uh pops could use some of his snuggles right now caught a bit of a cold he probably needs a break from using all that arcane energy zeb's keeping busy with erica at the village taylor's learning the basics but he's hungry to design ma cool abraham morning Glad to see you're still alive. Hope the male bird's been working all right for you. Yeah, we're yeah. doing all right on this side. Don't expect me to come around this time every morning. I'll have an assortment of goods to sell. And I bet you'll have goods you'll want to sell me. Uh, I, I probably will in the future. Right now, they're small, small, small pickings. Most of this will go straight back to Little Rock. Or to town council, anyway. Also, between you and me, your ma asked me to keep an eye on you. Oh, how sweet of her. I'm not sure why. I thought that's what the cat's there for. Ah, but don't you worry. I won't say a thing if you misbehave. Not a little kid anymore. No, no. We're, we're a big, strong, independent woman. Appreciate Morning. the message. Abraham, let's see what you've got for us. Sell to Little Rock today. Wait, I can buy stuff from him? Are those crab apples I'd buy them for? Or is that... It looks like that currency, just different color. I can make a potion. Oh, it increases my spell slots. Okay, that's cool. Oh, and I can make get the homesteader's house from him. Okay, awesome. Now, I want to see maybe what... I have a couple stacks of each thing, so let's see uh, if I can just sell some of this and Change. whatever I have of extra so that I can... Pleasure oops. I have the hell Feed is that? Me. Oh, my fucking... I'm hungry. Cool. Let's eat... What is this? How much will this fill me? Four? And... Mm, okay, whatever. I can always make another one. I think... Ma gave us the recipe for that. Well, I absolutely don't have enough to go buy anything from him. So let's go check on um, Abraham. See about that breathing mask. He was... That is not Abraham. Where the fuck did he go? Is he down by the miasma, I assume? Yeah, of course. Of course he is. Hello, Abraham. How about this we talk about that mask? mask? Oh, I don't even have to Old build it? You just give it? Fuck yeah, that's even better. Slow it down. Tilly, your Aunt Matilda found it years ago during one of our expeditions gotta thank aunt matilda again it's not going to make you invincible and it definitely won't honestly i don't need to be invincible i just need to be able to explore huck you don't understand it's a necessity for anyway, me to be able to explore out here insisting on going out into the miasma you might as well try and find something useful i guess mm -hmm, of course Dilly's old i should probably make a go and like channel some more food before we head out here so that i don't have to run into that starving issue again that was weird i just looked to the left and saw my door and it, like looked like it flashed red i was like really confused for a second let's just grab some more apples i was i forgot that i have to come to this tree and can't just uh grow them well yeah no it doesn't let me grow stuff off this tree so i kind of just got to wait my turn for getting food from here which is all right i suppose unless can i eat those i thought i had onions at some point didn't i make 
some onions when I was here the last time. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah, they are. Okay, yes. Yeah, so I can I can do that to these. Can I eat the corn too? Yeah, okay. Probably better to you know what? Yeah, no. Uh yeah, why not? I just don't want to blight it on accident. A few moments later. Uh oh. Ooh, wait a second. Is that gonna blight me? Is that gonna blight the plant if I channel like this? Yep. I, okay, well, I wanted to make sure that I knew what that different coloring was. Miasma, or channeling too much will infect your plants with miasma. Sick plants will stop growing. They will heal over time. Shit. Huck might know a better solution. You don't know about Aunt Matilda, but you do recall she had a knack for making useful elixirs. Probably this isn't safe to eat, I bet. But, you know what? It's alright. This should be enough to uh, get us out into the miasma. All, all the little bit of food we have on us. So let's go and... Ooh, more compost. You know, let's just leave it. Let's just leave it right there for now. And see what I... Oh, that scene. Come on, what are we scared of? We ain't scared of nothing. Let's just get that breathing mask on. Oh, it's like a Plague Doctor mask. Cool. That thing looks cool with its purple uh, glow around the eyes. Fuck yeah. We're looking snazzy as fuck out here. Let's activate this. I know we only have uh, four minutes out here, but it would be probably nice to be able to see what else is here. Also, it probably did just help me navigate. Plants in the miasma, they appear to be plant. Try taking the some back with you? Oh, okay. Cool. Give me that. Lesser miasma bulb, material for crafting, organic, a small organic orb with a little bit of miasma gas. Certain members of the academy theorized could create strong gardening implements. Ooh. All right, cool. Is that all I can... Okay, I can't grow these on my own. Like, I can't channel them or water them. So, just gonna have to deal with the fact that I only get one of those right there. Ooh, wait, do I have any more dynamite still? I didn't find... No, or blasting powder is what it's called. Yeah, I don't have any more of that, unfortunately. Don't know where I can find it. Maybe I... I don't know if I have to find it, or maybe I could make it. That would be actually really nice if I could make it, too. Lavender seedling is a plantable item brimming with purple petals. What's this hint? While hunting for treasure, I passed out at some point, and when I woke up, all the things I gathered were gone. They returned to where I found them. A sign from the sun? Possibly. I'm hopeful that so long as I can get out of here conscious, the miasma won't take the goods back. All the salvage, all these rare plants, they're simply too valuable to leave. Of course they are. Why would I, I'm not gonna come out here just to, just, to, ooh, wait, I have to think about the fact that I have to make the trip backwards too, so I really only have two minutes to look for shit in here, huh? Visions of treasure, uh, fruits I haven't seen in ages, uh, usable silver and linen, even recipes I've never heard of, and they seem to appear randomly without reason. Huck always makes it a point to demonize the miasma. Bless his heart, but I don't think he understands how useful it can be. I cannot wait to show him what I found. Like this? What is that? Stalk? Miasma stalk, I just guessed? Crab, uh, definitely a miasma crab apple. Oh, wait. Oh, is it blighting the shit in my inventory? Slowly? Uh-oh, that can't be good. Stalk is used for crafting, it's versatile. Corn stock. Okay. I think it's blighting this shit in my inventory. It might be what they're on about. Okay. That's no bueno. What else do we got? Any of this? No. Just markers to show my way out. Oh, is that? Oh, shit. Wait. That must be Anna Matilda's house. Hell yeah. Honestly, I knew I, I knew I was looking for it, but I kind of thought maybe it might be too far and I'd have to make another trip. Thank God it is this close, actually. All right. Let's steal that grill back. Where? Where is it? Up close, the grill seems fairly simple in construction. You'll likely need wood, metal, and an onion to set up. Did that, actually, did that actually say onion? I clicked too fast. On top of the grill, you'll notice a jar with a note on it. Take journal. Jar instructions. To whomever has the means to continue my work, I discovered a way to expedite dust eater growth. Combined with Fielding Gilbert method, there's dang er, tangible hope of fighting back the miasma. Take this specialized fertilizer, pour it down the offending miasma scar. Within seconds, a dust eater should bloom and seal the earth's wound. The world wasn't always like this. We can still heal our land. All right, cool. I wonder if Hux knows something about it and if he'll willingly reveal anything. I like that it acknowledges the fact that that fucker is like not wanting to, um, like he's being vague and mysterious about what knowledge he gives us. I don't know why though. Summer 77th, 20 YF. Sun blessed my return from the miasma today. 
My, uh, though my journey was unsettling, the cloud around me stirred, but nothing was visible. Through dense fog, I can only describe what I felt as a presence. Maybe it was the miasma itself? Like something was observing me. Like, it, like I'd been observing the miasma. My eyes are beginning to droop. Haven't seen Huck all day. Sure hope he knows his way back. Autumn, 12. Huck returned to camp. Apparently he made some friends with the local hoppers and got a little sidetracked. That scamp. I also found remnants of the academy, studies on combating miasma spread and mentions of eradicating it permanently. I wish I saw m I wish more saw the value in their research. It's the light mixed with darkness out here, though I guess that's true regardless of where you hang your cloak for the night. Autumn 48th. Bless the sun, I made it out of the miasma alive today. I was looking for scars, close to finding one too, I'm pretty sure. Perhaps that's why that what Perhaps that's why what happened happened. It was like my filter clogged even though it was freshly crafted. After emerging from the cloud, its presence lingered, like I'd brought a piece of the miasma back with me. Huck disappeared again. I trust him to find his way back, but after today, I may ask him to stick a little closer than usual. Hmm, these are all, I'm assuming, journals from Aunt Matilda and things that she did, since, I mean, this is her house who would leave notes here otherwise so was she starting to like be distrustful of a uh, little puck as well all right now there's one last thing I, I saw glittering around here the recipe for a stool a barrel and a jug all right and there's the minute mark which means i need to get my ass the fuck out of here so that i don't die in the miasma yeah all right yeah i do Ooh, what the hell is that down there i didn't even look over there when i when i was coming by hell we're gonna have to make a uh second trip in a bit i want to see what that is before uh doing anything else i don't know how the they were saying something about unclogging the oh fucking hell that is such a loud sound the timer for for that thing holy shit okay no i was saying uh there's a i'm assuming a way to unclog or make new filters that i'm probably gonna have to do like this one's not gonna be viable once i uh am finished with it here Maybe? I don't know. I just saw the count go back up to four minutes when I, uh, stepped out. So maybe I won't have to make a new one? Or maybe just making new ones is if I want to make them last longer? That's actually a fig- okay, yeah, okay. I'm not seeing things. There's outlines back there. I didn't know if I was just tripping for a moment. Hey, Huck. Did Huck- wait, did Huck follow- I- I meant to- uh, check to see if Huck was still following, but I was on a four minute timer and Huck was not the thing that was on my mind. I don't know if he actually followed us out at, or into there. Maybe not. He doesn't have a mask of his own. You know, unless he does have his own kitty mask. That would be nice. All right, now let's check out some of these recipe. Wait, do I have to wait? That. Oh, yeah. Okay. Okay. I, I thought like I had to do something to get them in here. I don't have to like read the notes in my inventory or anything. They're just there. Okay. So I definitely need the grill. That's like the only thing that we even thought we were going out there for. Those are decorations. Not too, too interested in those right now. There's also way markers and I could make a storage chest, but do I need a storage chest right now? Eh. I don't think so. Plus, I don't even have cotton ball. Bowl. Cotton bowl. I don't have cotton bowl, so I can't even do that. I, I mean, I could use the chest actually, seeing as my inventory is full of shit, but I don't know where to get cotton balls, so how the hell do I go about fixing my inventory? Oh, I can Tetris this shit? I'm... maybe? What? I'm trying to Tetris it? It's saying middle mouse button to rotate? Oh, I have to click middle That is annoying to hold and do. Okay. And... oop, oop, oop. Thank you. There we go. Basic grill. That I will place if it lets me, because it's always weird about where I can build shit. Can I build it up here? No, of course not. Okay. Well, then let's put it, yeah, right here, right there. Cool. Now I should be able to make some better foods for myself. I can make birch beer. I didn't think that that was what that was going to be used for, but I'm glad nonetheless. Well, for now, I suppose if I'm going to have to do, well, I guess the only thing I really can do is either these grilled apples or those. Well, I might as well do all of them. Seeing as I can't do anything else with them, so let's just let's just make every bit that I, that I can of it. Oh, I have to do this for each individual food, but it gets faster each time I, as long <laughs> the longer I hold it. Okay, that's cool. 
I like that. That actually does take a good bit while. I didn't see this quest up here about talking to Huck about the mysterious shark, so let's do that while we wait for the food. Yeah, I do have the grill. Of course I have the grill. I'm already cooking on it. I know what that is. But how is it stating no? Is it the compost? You think that you smell? Because I have several of that on me. It would be a very potent smell. You might have seen a scar already. There are these huge cavities in the earth that let out all this miasma. Is that, that that thing I was going on about uh, while I was leaving out? That bit, shiny bit down there? Just like the one on your homestead, only stunted. So in theory, you pour this fertilizer into the scar, and the dust eater instantly grows full size, soaking up the surrounding me. I said, in theory. It's easy. Wait, is this the, um, is this going to be the way that maybe I can fix the blight that I put on that plant? We didn't know if it was the location, the age of the tree, or what, but it didn't seem to do anything. And she died before we could do any more tests. You're still welcome to try, of course. Just don't get your hopes up. All right, bud? Yeah, cool. Okay, so it can be used on scars, concocted by Matilda, and it causes the dust eaters to come. All right, cool. I just made two more potions. Uh, so that we could see more shit once we go back in since Huck needs us to go and apply the fertilizer to the scar And I'm definitely interested in seeing what uh, happens when we try to put this shit on the scar. So let's go uh, The mask seems to be full charge as well uh, Wrong spot mm, Actually, wait a second. I really need to get this shit out of my inventory Can I stack these? Oh my god, thank you. Why didn't you stack before? Okay uh, And you know what as long as I don't get anything that is a multi spot taker, too many of those. We should be fine. Let's go try to put this stuff on the scar in front of her house. Maybe we'll encounter whatever that figure was in in there that we saw in that little cutscene. Oh, Huck actually Ow, I bit the fuck out of my tongue. Huck didn't actually follow us in. What a shame. I mean, probably better for his lungs, to be fair, but what a shame. Our partner doesn't get to come and explore with us. Oh, yeah, that's, that is what is happening right there. That is, like, the, the, uh, what's-the-name is pouring out of it. Okay. I didn't even see it. I just kind of saw that it was, uh, a thing. I didn't even really see that Miasma was gushing out of it like that. And it grew a tree. How nice. I got a nice green thumb, even with Miasma. Look at that. And what, does that open up more for us to explore? Ooh, and another hint tome. We love that. And one of those random spawns that we read about as well. What is that? Uh, a dust eater has sprouted. The miasma seems to be slightly less. You're not sure. Perhaps Huckleberry might know more. Always Huckleberry might know this. Huckleberry might know that. Huckleberry this. Huckleberry that. Fuck Huckleberry. He's hiding something from us. I just don't know what. The Field and Gilbert method. Examining the effects of miasma spread and corruption have yielded critical results and efforts to cease its spread. This led to establishment of the Field and Gilbert method. This requires concocting fertilizer that is poured into a miasma scar wherein the dust eater burrows into the infected earth to absorb the miasma. The roots, if able to prosper, also double as suture for the terrain wound and seal the pocket from lethal miasma bursts. While monumental in the Academy's campaign to eliminate miasma, the Field and Gilbert method is incomplete. And that's what it is. Old blanket, one of Aunt Matilda's old belongings. A small blanket woven from coarse yarn. Could I break that down and get some, uh, cotton bowl from it, maybe? Letter, letter from Marvin. Tilly, I'm sorry so many moons have passed since my last letter, sis. I've had my hands full with the kids. Jezebel's already developed a penchant for magic, and Zeb's found an affinity for fabrics. I sense a lot of you and Jezebel, fascinated by the mysteries of the world rarely satisfied with the answer given and always falling into trouble i know you've always wanted me to come with you but you ought to understand that we have different callings in life and mine is looking after these children i'm sure huckleberry is treating you well the hell is marv is this oh pops copy sending you now have people you can write to send a letter uh click on the mail bill and select your topic who knows what you might learn may surprise you miasma creature awareness whoa 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 there's enemies well i plan to sneak into the academy to see if anything was salvageable but these hoppers you take one step too close they attack 
I am wholly unprepared. Ripple would at least let me see their range of sight. I require more corn. Luckily for me, I have enough corn. I was smart enough to uh, go ahead and bring them. Oh, oh, I see all the... Damn, there actually are a lot of fuckers in here. But thankfully, they're not in this area. Oh, drop that fawn! <laughs> fucking hell, I didn't know know that they were fucking underground in holes. God damn, that bout startled the fuck out of me. Piece of shit. That bout scared my fucking pants off, dog. Holy shit. I was not expecting some fucker to just jump out at me like that. Wait, did I? Oh, give me that. Gimme, give gimme, give gimme give that. Gimme that ass. Gimme that miasma ass from a bat. Gimme that me. Oh, that's a potion I need. Thank you, thank you. Can I step in the water? No, I can't step in the water. Unfort. Ah, no, 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 you motherfucker. I'm trying to sparingly use this mana because it doesn't exactly come. God ah, damn, motherfuckers. Really trying to make it so that I can't. I'm working to get my make my way. Honestly, I shouldn't even. I should not even bother. I'm. It's gonna take me a minute to get back. Let's go. Let's go. Let Huck know that I'm a okay. You piece of shit. Piece of shit. You're all a bunch of shit fuckers. Okay. <laughs> There's definitely no more through this way. Okay. I am safe as can be. Am I gonna? make it I have five oh am I gonna make I'm gonna have to bust some of my health down but I'll make it ooga ooga let's go get me out this shit here we go hi Hawk okay well do I just, yeah here Hawk I'll tell you what happened mm-hmm pretty nice right it's still taking out my fucking health just as you still easy. Have a jar, don't you? I bet you have enough fertilizer left over. Probably just need to add a little filler. I okay. This level of miasma, I think cotton will be fine. Just liquefy it in the cauldron and pour it into the same jar. That should do it. Um what I'm more I don't about is the filter in that mask. Have cotton, Huck. How where do you expect me to get cotton? I didn't even find any out there those oh now you're letting me sell in stacks instead of single you motherfucker why'd you wait till the second time uh yeah let's just sell you the wood right now actually i maybe needed that wood fuck it's all right i buy it back i don't need to buy it back fuck that i could uh, i don't have enough for that we're broke bitches right now we're broke witches right now we can't we can't go buy in two two you leaving Alrighty. Oh, there he goes. I guess 11 o'clock is his leave time. Well then. Goodbye, Abraham. See you tomorrow. I have a hell of a full inventory right now. So, um, I'd like to be able to make a chest, but I can't because I need cotton bowl and this mother. Wait. Wait, didn't I pick up? Oh, I do have cotton. I mean, of course I have cotton. Honestly, I kind of forgot that these were all seedlings that were in our inventory and not just, uh... Actually, you know what? I, w I don't know what I was thinking. I didn't even really look at them yet. Okay. Good thing I decided to use my brain for once, yeah? There we go. I assume I, I was meant to place them out of each other's range is why I did it that way. Uh, which one? I think this one's the cotton one. Let's just water up this plant real quick and get her to grow. Voila! Wait, do I have to channel this one even more? Maybe? Do I have to water it some more? No? Channel? I guess, oh, maybe grow the arms, I suppose. Oh, gotta still bring it up from the bottom and channel it to that arm. And there we go. And I just need, I'm hoping I just need one bit of, no, I don't, I didn't mean to start channeling again. I just want to harvest that. There we go. I, I do got cotton bowl now. There we go. I hope I only need one of these to uh, melt down in the, in the, uh, did they say in the cauldron or in the, uh, I'm assuming in the cauldron, not the grill. And there is my fertilizer. 
Restoration of the canyon. Check the logbook for new tasks. Okay, good. That progressed something too. All right, everyone. I think we're going to go ahead and end this episode here. We had two successful run-throughs of the Miasma, and I didn't die, which is always solid when I go an episode without dying. I almost died. We didn't but it was it was pretty solid so i hope you guys enjoyed this episode if you did don't forget to smack that like button drop a comment down below subscribe to the channel and turn on that bell notification so you guys do not miss when the next episode comes out and as always i hope you all enjoy the rest of your day and i will see you next time peace